Tony Darling here with the making of Volcon 2012. I'm here with Jay. Jay, tell me a little bit about your piece. Oh, we have here some of the prize support for Phoenix Volcon 2012. You see this beautiful engraved sword. It says Venatus Ani 2012. This is for the victor of the convention, the top gamer at the convention. And you'll see our centurion back here holding a wooden sword. And this one here is the uh, sword that will be given to the victor of the uh, Vulcan games. And uh, those are our giant-sized Roman-themed games, the Gladiatorial Coliseum and the Hippodrome, where the chariot races will occur. person with the most victories on those games will end up with this beautiful wooden sword. Jay, tell me a little bit about um, how you determine the top gamer. Absolutely. We actually have a scoring system that we've been using throughout the year. We have a database. We keep track of people playing games throughout the entire Volcon season. So people have been scoring points, playing games, participating in tournaments and attending events at all of our arena events and so we already have point totals for that and during the course of the convention we'll be tracking who's playing games, winning tournaments, playing our, our Vulcan games and they get extra points for those because obviously they're themed for the event and then that database we're going to get a total on it at the end of the convention and the very last thing we'll do before everyone leaves exhausted and happy at the tail end is we will go ahead and tally those totals up, find out who the gamer of the year is and then at our award ceremony at the end of the convention will be presenting this beautiful sword to them. Excellent. So much to look forward to. So tell us a little bit about the arena events that you have coming up this year and maybe what's coming up next year. Yeah, we're going to be having a whole new season of Volcon, fresh arena events at stores here in the Valley. We're going to do something a little bit new. Uh, we haven't announced the location yet, but we're actually going to be moving w at least one of the events outside of the Phoenix area. Um, and so that's going to be kind of exciting. We're looking forward to that. Uh, with this last year, we also did a charity event with our Back to Basic event. We're hoping to do a follow-up charity event this next year, and we'll be releasing some information about that as the convention wraps up. So um, we've got a lot more events fun in store mm -hmm. and we're you know always looking forward so even though we're wrapping up the build on Phoenix Volcon 2012 and excited about the event we've already been working and planning for Phoenix Volcon 2013. All right guys we're checking out here with Jay we'll see you all next weekend and make sure to pre-register at the website below for Volcon 2012.